Yeah, that bill had quite the back and forth today, but the main takeaway with this unification bill is recruitment and retention. Senator David said the state is having a tough time keeping law enforcement right now. We're having a real problem right now being able to recruit and retain our public safety officers. This bill passing through Senate today would consolidate OHP, OSBI and OBN under the Department of Public Safety with an appointed commissioner of public safety. There's that fear of putting that one commissioner over all three agencies. What it truly comes down to is that we as the legislature always have oversight. And the bill didn't pass without a fight. Why in the world would we not have a representative from our police departments and our sheriff's department in this formulation of this huge change? Change is scary, and so there are some concerns out there, but no, they, this is the first time we have tried to unify these agencies and to have everyone's input. Senator David also says the bill would include training and a mental health facility for law enforcement. We all know that with the concerns that have swept across the nation with lack of training in law enforcement, that was a high priority for us. It's making sure our, our officers have the, the best training possible. And if this bill makes it through the House, the effective dates for this uh, agencies will be July 1st, 2023. At the Capitol, Megan Mosley, KOCO 5 News.